The sensory tab can be used to hide small objects that kids must then identify or differentiate by touch. To make a sensory tub, take a large plastic container. The size of the container will depend on the number of children you have in your group. You can fill the container with all kinds of legumes because they are not too expensive and there are so many kinds that you can make a nice mix. But obviously, you must make sure that the children are not allergic to the legumes. You may also fill the container with semolina. But what I much prefer is rice. You can buy a big bag of rice at a very reasonable price and you can make it interesting by coloring the rice. To color the rice, it's very simple. Take a plastic bag, put food coloring in it and then add the rice. Mix well and the colored rice is ready to be poured into the sensory tub. When creating the sensory tub, involve children in the rice coloring. It will be fun and it is also a good opportunity to teach them the concept of primary and secondary colors. You could give each of them a small plastic bag so they can color a portion of the rice. The food color is absorbed by the rice very quickly and children can play in their sensory tub right away. If you need the sensory tub for another activity, store the colored rice in a large plastic bag until you need it again. I will make other videos with specific activities. Happy exploring!